distributive flow. We are going to use exactly the same properties like we use in regular math. Simply we are going to distribute A into the parentheses. So A times B is going to give me AB. A times C is going to give me AC. If you are going to implement this function, you are going to see something like this. I have A and it with B or C. Okay. Now, if you want to find the output function of this circuit, you are going to have A. This is going to be B or C. So output is A and B or C. If you want to implement this function, which is equivalent to this one, you are going to have two end gates. Okay, I have A and B, and I have another end gate which has inputs A, C, okay, and both of them are odd together. And I have A, B, or A, C. These two circuits are equivalent.